Hello guys, it's Steve. Um, it is New Year's. It's January 1st, 2016. Uh, I'm watching the news right now. Uh, we've talked about the weather, but uh, Tom Skilling's talking about the weather. But um, I just saw in the news like a few minutes ago uh, that uh, there are people and shit who uh, decided to swim in Lake Michigan. Are you kidding me? It's fucking like... Hang on, let me see what the weather is. Let's wait for Tom Skilling to hurry up and talk about the weather. Or tell us what the temperature is. Tonight's going to be 20 degrees. I don't know, it has to be like in the 30s or 40s in time, I'm not going to waste my time looking at the TV, but, yeah, it's like in the 20s or 30s or whatever, and fucking there are people swimming in Lake Michigan, swimming in Lake Michigan and shit. Are you fucking kidding me? It's fucking... Sorry if I spit. It's freezing as hell outside. It's freezing as fuck outside. How the fuck could you go swimming and shit? You're gonna get pneumonia. Or fucking bronchitis or... I don't know. Whatever fucking sickness. You're gonna get sick and shit if you do that. If you swim in Lake Michigan... In the lake, fucking in the freezing cold and shit. How the fuck could you people do that? Every year, it's basically a tradition. But, uh... Yeah. Let me take a drink of my, uh... Oh, shit! Fuck! I apologize about that, I actually... When I opened up my monster, I all splattered and shit. I fucking hate when that happens. But, uh, yeah, anyway, it's New Year's Day, uh, it's the first day of 2016, and, uh, I want to wish everybody a Happy New Year's, uh, it's my first video of 2016, I did a video last night, I uploaded my Greatest Moments video, I added, like, not every single funny and great and part of all my videos, but some of them, because it would take forever to fucking make and shit, you know, but, uh, I had some, and posted it last night, if you want to see it, go right ahead, uh, but it's a new year, uh, hopefully this year could be a good year, uh, 2015 was, uh, it wasn't bad, uh, 2014 was bad, 2015 was better, um, basically I'm gonna talk about some of the good things about, uh, 2015 and shit, and I got it on a piece of paper right here, but, uh, alright, uh, so yeah, I'm basically gonna talk about some of the good things about 2015, and, uh, maybe some of the bad things too. Alright, uh, one thing about 2015 that was good was I graduated high school, uh, yeah, I finished my senior year of high school and graduated, uh, that was good, uh, class of 2015, I completed high school, yeah, I got a high school diploma, and that was fucking awesome and shit, you know? Graduating high school is always a good thing, uh, of course, uh, a couple of days after graduation night was not great because I got sick because it was freezing as hell graduation, but, uh, I fucking graduated and that's a good thing. Another good thing, second good thing about 2015, uh, the Chicago Blackhawks, my favorite hockey team, uh, won the Stanley Cup, uh, yeah, they won the Stanley Cup, a good year for them, uh, they beat the Predators in the first round, uh, one of the games, they went to like, I don't know, a couple overtimes and won the game, 
Remember, there's a game the Blackhawks were down three games to nothing or whatever, or down three nothing in game one, and then they came back and won the game in overtime. They won another game in overtime. They ended up beating the Predators in the first round. They swept Minnesota in the second round. They beat Anaheim in the conference finals. Uh, they lost game one. Game two was, I remember game two was actually the the day of my graduation, I had to miss some of the game because it was on my graduation night. Remember the Blackhawks won that game in a triple overtime or whatever. Game 3 they lost, game 4 they won, game 5 they lost, game 6 and game 7 they won. And they beat the Tampa Bay Lightning in 6 games to win the Stanley Cup. Uh, it was the first one on home ice since like the 30s or whatever. I don't know. It's been a long time. But they won another Stanley Cup. Third Stanley Cup in 6 years. They won in 2010. They won in 2013. Now they won another one last year. And uh, yeah. Another good thing about 2015, the Chicago Cubs, my favorite baseball team, was actually really good. They had a really good year. They made it to the playoffs. They were so fucking good. I actually had fun watching them. You know, it's not like every other year where I watch the Cubs. It's not really exciting watching them. I don't look forward to watching them because uh, they're bad all the time. They would always lose or whatever. But last season, they were fucking good. They win a lot of games and shit. You know, they won like 96, 97 games. They made it to the playoffs for the first time since 2008. And they actually won a playoff series. Well, they beat the Pirates for the wild card. And they beat the Cardinals in the first round. Which is good. Sadly, they got swept by the Mets in the fucking NLCS. I thought they'd totally beat the Mets. Now... If they could beat the Pirates and the Cardinals, how the fuck can't they beat the Mets and shit? They swept the Mets during the regular season, too, I remember. They swept them in a four-game series at Wrigley Field, and they swept them in a uh, three-game series in New York. So I knew for sure the Cubs would totally beat the Mets and go to the World Series for the first time since 1945. But no, they got swept by the Mets instead. I got shocked and shit. The Royals ended up winning the World Series, so congrats to them. I'm ha I was happy when they won. But And the Pirates and the Cardinals were the only two teams that were better than the Cubs. And they were both in the Cubs division. And yet the Cubs beat them. But they lost to the fucking Mets. Oh well, whatever. I'm totally looking forward to them next year. Next year, they'll probably be even better. They'll probably even win more games. Hopefully, uh... I say maybe a hundred games or whatever. Uh, they got Jason Hayward, one of the best uh, outfielders in the game from the Cardinals. They got uh, John Lackey from the Cardinals. They got Ben Zobris from the World Champion Royals. I don't know, but they had a good year last year, and they got a lot of good players during the off season. And uh, I'm totally looking forward to seeing them in 2016. Hopefully, they can win the World Series. Uh. uh Another good thing, uh, I don't know, the summer was good. Just had a good summer and shit. You know, again, watching the Cubs this summer was awesome. Uh, you know, and I hung out with my friend Adrian a lot this summer. Uh, we basically would go to the baseball field every day and play baseball. Or not every day, but maybe almost every week we would hang out. And we would uh, play baseball and shit. Uh, yeah. Another good thing about 2015 was a couple of my friends who moved away back in 2012 they actually came to visit for the first time since they moved away in 2012. Uh, yeah. I met up with some of my friends who moved away in 2012 for the first time since they moved. Uh, that was awesome. But, uh... Yeah, there were probably more good things. Again, the summer was good. Uh, I'm trying to think. Uh, some of the bad things were, uh, you know, again the Cubs losing to the Mets. That was the, that was sad. Uh, 
It's the begin start of the year wasn't really the best and shit, you know. We had a lot of fucking uh sub zero temperatures at the beginning of this year, like in January and February. Oh god, and we had a blizzard too, the blizzard of twenty fifteen in Chicago or whatever. We had a it was like a blizzard or whatever, it was a lot of snow and shit, but uh what other bad things? I don't really know. But yeah, other than that, it's been a pretty good year in 2015. I'm looking forward to 2016. Hopefully, maybe this year could be even better. Uh, and yeah. And the protesters say they will continue these demonstrations until Mayor Ron Emanuel resigns. The mayor himself has said. Yeah. Oh my God! Get a life, you people who are protesting. They protest for stupid reasons. It's not gonna. I'm not gonna fucking uh talk about it, but. It's not gonna solve anything. But, uh. Yeah. So. Hopefully 2016 could be a good year. Um. Yeah. So I wish everybody a great 2016. For all you good people, for all you bad people, for all, for all you haters or whatever. If I hate you or you hate me, I hope you guys have a shitty 25th or 26th. That's, that's, you know, that's another thing. At the beginning of every new year, you know, everyone's biggest mistake is we're, we're used to the date the previous year. Like, no matter if we, you know, write it on a piece of paper, like we write the date on a piece of paper, say, let's just say, for example, it's 2013 or whatever. It's 2013, the beginning of 2013. When we write the date, we like January 16th, 2013 instead we write january 16th or 13 whatever january 13th 2012 we we still act we accidentally write 2012 because we're, we're used to 2012 we're used to the previous year when it's actually 2013 same thing if it's like 2014 we're used to 2013 we still accidentally write 2013 we accidentally say or write 2013 when it's the new year you know that's everybody's biggest mistake uh it's 2016 and i almost said 2015 well i said 2015 accidentally that's everybody's biggest mistake we act we're, we're used to the the previous year so we accidentally write down the previous year instead of this new year that's everybody's I, we are i end up getting used to it like usually maybe in february or march or whatever but in january yeah i still kind of accidentally you know say the previous year uh, instead of this year everybody does not just me everybody does Five slash or one slash sixteen slash slash fifteen. Oops, I put fifteen. It's two thousand sixteen now, not two thousand fifteen. Uh oh, don't be surprised if I accidentally put two thousand fifteen on the dates of one of my videos, one of my vlogs or whatever. I put the date in my vlogs. I might accidentally put twenty fifteen still, even though it's twenty sixteen. If I do, correct me and I'll change it. So yeah. Uh, and I go, what am I saying? I go, fucking, I hope you guys have a good 2016, uh, I'll be making a lot more videos this year, and, uh, yeah, so, uh, see you later, guys, goodbye.